I just, I don't know what's Justin's problem. She just can't do crap. This guy cannot go to bed. Why? Just make it into the next room. You'll be fine. What is wrong with Jesslyn? <laughs> what is her problem? What's up you guys? It's Allie and I'm here with episode 14 of the 100 baby challenge. We're back with the Mills family and all of the crazy stuff that goes on in our household. Fun times. So happy to be back. We really need someone to repair that computer and we'll probably get to it then no stop seeing what's happening just do your homework do your homework please all right if you need social then talk to your dad what in the world colt i told you to play oh yay we got lots of money good Watch toddler videos. Stop that. Leave him alone. He's playing. Why is he embarrassed? Oh my gosh, there's so much craziness happening in our family right now. Jeez. You go play dolls. Ah! I can't even handle it all. Why is she still not doing her homework? I mean, calling her dad now. Fine, how about you sit here and watch Current Channel with your mom and talk to her? How about you do that? Why can't she play with the dolls? Why aren't they doing what I'm telling them to do? You're making things difficult. Just resume the shapes you were doing, buddy. Oh my gosh. This family's nutso. I don't know if I can make through this, guys. <laughs> it's gonna be a lot of hard work. How long until the twins age up, actually? Five days. Oh my gosh. What is wrong with... What is wrong with you, kid? Fine, go do that and give yourself a pep talk. Jeez, I don't know what's wrong with their with our children today. They're all just acting like crazy people. Okay, she apparently feels like her privacy has been invaded. So let's just have her call her dad, chat with your daddy, and then actually we need to replace her bed now. Needs to be a teenager bed. Should have enough. Yeah. And then we can move this little thing, this little thing over here. A little Andrea. Perfect. Alright, Griffin. Why can't you do what I tell you to do? What is wrong with you people? Stop doing that. How about you go repair this? Then you need to start working on your next book. I think she's been writing a book, but I can't remember. Can you not call your dad? Fine, go take a nap. <laughs> I don't know what else to tell her to do. <laughs> you can go. 
go play with a toy. Andrea's kind of sick of that. So let's have her play with a toy until Anna can show her how to use the potty. There's something wrong with her. Like, something's not right. I'm not sure what exactly is going on why everyone's like focusing on jesslyn just sleep do something i don't get it so weird to me how they can't like do anything around Jesslyn. Jesslyn's like broken. Yay, Isabel fixed the computer. Okay, let's have her scavenge for parts. Could always use that extra money. Oh, good job, Anna. Thank you. I appreciate you being so helpful. Now it's time to potty train Andrea. So stop doing that. Axel, you can play with a toy now yourself. Hey, she got more parts. So she can throw that away and sell another part. For ten simoleons. And then let's see. Okay, she needs to start a new book. Let's try a fantasy book this time. Right? Did I pick fantasy? I don't know if I picked on it. Fantasy. I don't think we've written a fantasy yet. I don't know. We've written a lot of books. I can't really remember all of them. If I'm being honest. Jasper is working out. Let's have you go play with the toy. Sure, the raven headmistress. Sounds good to me. <laughs> Sounds like a bestseller to me. I'm drinking, sorry guys. <laughs> I'm drinking my McDonald's drink. Jasper, if you're done playing with toys, you need to put them away. Oh, he still does not want siblings. You need to stop this. Madness. Put it away. You can go sit and watch TV. I need them to be able to go to school. This is too much. He's not hot-headed, I don't think. Like, there's no reason for him to get angry at his siblings for no reason. Jeez. He's literally pounding the ground as he walks. He's like, I hate this, I hate this so much. And I'm just like, well, you know, deal with it. Can we actually afford to buy that little, like, exercise thing for kids? That little, like, monkey bar thing? That'd be kind of nice to have. Ah, oh, it's too expensive. It's 800 doll- 800 simoleons. Gosh. When we can, we should try and get that. Alright, he's hungry, so let's grab the food out. It is kind of lunchtime. I didn't even think about it. There's five left on that. Grab one of those, put the rest in there. Alright, go get yourself some food. Who else is hungry? 
Not you. Not you. You're hungry. You're not hungry. You're all over the place, so you can eat when you're done potty training. What about Isabel? Nope. Just the toddlers. Okay. Okay. He's done with that. How about you clean that up? I guess you can put that away. So you don't need to keep that out. There's like so little room in this. I think when we get our first teenager, what we'll do is we'll move Jasper and Griffin into this room together and then turn this into the twins rooms. Um, so we'll just have to stockpile money. We probably won't be able to buy that monkey bar thing for a while. I was actually wondering if I could change the rules on this challenge again and let our teenagers actually have jobs <laughs> because that would be really helpful. <laughs> Because, I mean, they're not technically in the challenge, so I don't see why they couldn't do it. Okay, you go get food. How about you go do that, and then you can eat too. Um, Anna, mop that. Clean. And you can watch current channel. I might want to actually extend our living room and like there's a lot of stuff we have to do like this house is just so small and it is like our secondary stepping stone house to get to like a bigger one eventually I'm assuming what no you cannot be a homewrecker like you're well I mean it's not his dad he's literally red what is wrong with him what the heck you need to go cool down buddy Take a cold shower. Oh my gosh. I can't believe he just did that. We have another home wrecker. And this time it's in our family. Okay, you can go play the games. Jeez, and Jesslyn's like sleeping through all of this. Good for you, Jesslyn. Good for you. I might actually go ahead and trade up her violin for like a adult one. So that she can play the violin. Because that's kind of her pastime thing that she does. Ah, oh, that was so expensive. Jeez. Let's have her, she can add to her Simstagram story, check her social media, and then chat with her dad, and then practice the violin. Oh, do we need to get an outside trash can? Darn. That one doesn't count? How does that one not count? <sighs> Just put that one there. <laughs> that's the one that's like cheapest. <laughs> Cause that's the unpleasant surroundings. I didn't realize that what that's what Anna was like feeling. Did you take a cold shower? You need to take another one. Ugh. Our surroundings suck right now. Wait. He is a dirty diaper? Oh gosh. Oh gosh. You need to change his diaper. Go give him a bubble bath.
This is such a disaster area. We're just trying our best, guys. We're trying our best. Icky plumbing? What What does that mean? Gross. The plumbing is dirty and desperately needs to be cleaned. I don't know what that means. Oh, that that needs to be cleaned. Can you clean that? No. Darn it. It's just making him worse. Ah! What is wrong with this thing? Just grab a serving. Our game is falling apart. Actually, gonna have her clean this. Then she can eat. She's kind of hungry. Oh boy. How's her little Axel boy doing? Okay, I guess. He's kind of like the calm one. I thought I gave my children angelic traits, but apparently not. Why does she keep doing that? She's really tired, so she needs to go to bed. So, you need to clean this up, and then actually you need to do your homework. Because you guys are going to school tomorrow. I don't care what happens. You're going to school tomorrow. This guy's tired, too. He needs to go to bed. What is the problem? I don't get what is going on with this whole sight unsee thing. It just keeps going. It's like a cycle of awfulness. Just go to sleep. Please. Eat your food. Stop talking about all this garbage. Do I need to, like, reset a sim? Is that what needs to happen here? <sighs> what is wrong with you? I just, I don't know what's Justin's problem. She just can't do crap. This guy cannot go to bed. Why? Oh, 
Just make it into the next room. You'll be fine. What is wrong with Jesslyn? <laughs> what is her problem? Okay, you guys, I'm going to reset her. Okay, you guys, I think I solved the problem. I think Jesslyn's CC clothes might have been, like, broken or something. Because they were, like, making everyone think that she was indecent in some way. And so they were, like, walking in on her in the bathroom, basically. It was really weird and strange. I'm just happy that it's over because it lasted way too long. So, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Why does everything break in this family? Why? Jeez. No more seeing what's happening. No more of that crap. Oh, you were just chatting. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> They're just chatting and I'm like, no! <laughs> Because that was just like the weirdest, longest encounter. I just, I was done. Okay, so let's check on birthdays. So we've got seven more days for Jasper. Twelve days for Griffin. Five. And also five, but it says six. Five and five days. No, you're not going to babble. You're going to go to bed, buddy. You are tired. I'm just gonna have her go take a bubble bath and then head to bed because this has been a crazy day and I'm done with it actually she shouldn't head to bed let's have her go eat this pasta you should definitely head to bed Man, it has been a long, long day. Um, that was a lot of work that you guys missed. Because <laughs> it would have been really boring for you to uh, watch me try and fix and consistently reset Sims. What in the world? Go to bed. Sleep. Can you not do that? Do I have to reset you too? Is is everything broken? What is the... Thank you. Jeez. This house is n running on netso pills or something. Okay, don't put that away because Jesslyn will put that away. You should go play a game for a little bit before you go to bed. Oh my gosh. This is crazy. Alright guys, we'll be back in the morning when everyone's awake and ready to go to school and out of my hair. Wonderful. Alright you guys, it's morning time. We thankfully did not have any children wake up throughout the night or any toddlers wake up from bad nightmares or monsters under the bed. So I think the lights are working, you guys. <laughs> that makes me so happy. It looks like Colt is waking up, Griffin's waking up. Everybody's waking up! Yay! Alright, Anna... Let's have you wake up. Jeez. So much crap going on. Uh, clean that. Take a shower. Jesslyn, we, we're gonna need you to make the breakfast this morning. We do have a fire alarm, right? Yes, we do. Hallelujah. Alright, uh, Griffin, you can change outfit. And then, let's have you play with a toy until the food's ready. Um, Griffin, you can also change into your regular clothes. Go draw something for a little bit.
Perfect. Thank you. So much, Isabel. It's like right from the get-go in the morning, we just are non-stop with everything that we have to do. It's crazy. No, don't daydream. Never mind. You can change. And then come exercise. Since you like to do that. Do more push-ups. And all that crap. <laughs> Axel is really hungry, so let's wait until the food's ready to wake him up. Just so that we don't have any uh, threatening of taking away our children anymore. That's never fun. Finish that food, Jesslyn! Finish it! Isabel, you can continue writing. The Raven Headmistress. Again, I feel like it's gonna be a bestseller. Hopefully. <laughs> We'll just have her get leftovers when she's done. She really needs fun though. She needs a lot of crap. Oh, perfect. Okay. Um, right, you grab a serving. Oh, you're not really that hungry. Let's have you go get ready. Come sit over here, add to your Instagram story, and check your social whatever, and chat with your dad. Alright, um, Andrea, let's move the food over here. Andrea, come grab a serving. Hold, finish with that. Grab a serving. As soon as you're done with that, you're not hungry. You're not hungry. Come watch crap. Griffin, you can go play dolls. Eat! For crying out loud, what is your problem? Why do we have so much problems with people? It's like crazy town up in here. Yeah, just, just do whatever you need to do, okay? You don't need to sit down. Just do your crap. Oh, thank goodness. She has 36 followers. That's awesome. Good for you, Jesslyn. Maybe you'll be our social media maven. I have a feeling that is your future. Oh, boy. You really need to like play games before you go to school because you're going to be like having a horrible day if you don't. You call your dad. Are you done eating, Missy May? Uh, Isabel can give you a bath. I told I told Anna to clean that. Why didn't she clean it? I need more teenagers they can do teen stuff for my teen labor. <laughs> uh, no, don't clean it. Just, just go. Just do what I need you to do. He 
He's done with that. So you can go watch toddler videos. Let's put that away so it doesn't go bad. Griffin, how about you come and clean these up for us? Clean up, clean up, clean up, clean up. Jasper, sit, and watch TV. He just finished with that. So actually, Jesslyn, how about you stop that? And potty train. Ah, she's gotta go to high school. Okay, fine. Fine, go to school. Sorry, Anna. <laughs> Sorry. You can go play dolls until your mom can take care of you. It does feel relieving now that we don't have to take care of four sims, though. Okay. Andrea's done. So she can go play dolls. No, just go play dolls by herself. And then can clean. Actually, don't worry about cleaning it yet. Just potty train, axle, and then you can give him a bath. <laughs> Alright guys, I would say there's probably no need in watching Isabel take care of three toddlers, which is a tall task in any scenario, so I am going to skip at this part and come back when the kids have arrived back from school. Alright you guys, the kids are back from school. I'm sending the toddlers to all take a nap because they're all pretty, uh, pretty tired. So, we're just gonna start taking care of everybody else's needs. She can sit, watch TV. He needs to use the bathroom. Oh, okay. Yeah, you do that. Use, sit, and do your homework. You are pretty hungry, so how about you have a quick meal? Some chips? Alright. Sometimes. Right. No. We're never doing that again. We're never letting people come hang out again. Because then they never leave, apparently. Because that's a thing. I'm actually going to have her go clean this up. And, yeah, you should probably pay your bills. <laughs> Oh, man. And then finish writing The Raven Headmistress. I just love that title. It's like such a good title. Clean that up. Oh, jeez. Really? Really? Go use that bathroom. Repair that. And then pay bills. And then oh, nope, don't pay bills twice. Definitely can't do that twice.
Look how cute they are all snuggled up by their pillows taking a nap. How adorable. Wish these things would just go away. And have her eat a quick snack. Just so much to do, so little time. Can't believe our bills are up to 500 simoleons. It's so much. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and have her serve dinner. Um, let's do a salad tonight. Jasper's done with his homework. So, how about you go work out since you're tense? I think that's enough TV. You can probably do your homework now. Clean that up. Do your homework. It's literally like a form of business now that when things break, we make money from it <laughs> because of how many parts. I mean, oh my gosh, something just broke. This is insane. <laughs> Everything breaks in this house. We should probably be using the parts to upgrade things so they stop breaking, but um, that's not how we roll in this family. Andrew just woke up. Um... How about you go play dolls with Andrea? Because dinner will be ready soon and then you guys can eat. Because I know you're hungry. <laughs> yeah. Axel just woke up too. He can actually use the potty now? Good. After he's done doing that, he can probably play something. Whew. You can play with Choppy, the monster. Alright, dinner's ready. So, let's have these guys stop doing that. And go grab a serving. You're done, you can grab a serving. You can grab a serving. You can grab a serving. And you can grab a serving. And I'm actually going to have you repair this this time. When you're done with your homework. Might be a collision here. I don't know. Will it work out? Will it work out? Can Andrea get her food? <laughs> yes, she can. Perfect. I think this is probably the smoothest we've had as far as days go. Like, this is the one with the least problems so far. Alright, 
confess, Karangi. Chima Wimple, Gorg. Other than everything breaking, but like I said, that's kind of been turned into a business for us. We make a lot of money when we break things. So by all means, keep breaking things. We'll all be expert repair women and men by the end of this. By adulthood. <laughs> Which is wonderful. I love it. I'll have you go clean that up so that you can do crap. You can go do that. You need to use the bathroom. But Anna's gonna do that. So, Anna, don't forget your book. It's yours. Jessalyn, this one's yours. I think she's gonna put it away. You know what? I'll just have Jessalyn clean that up. Put this away. Empty the trash. Control. Oh, the crazy times we have here in our home. When you're trying to control seven, eight. Sorry. It sims at the same time. It's a lot of work. Um, what should you do, Jasper? How about you go play with Colt? Play dolls with Colt. Wait, Colt has something to do when he's done. What? You didn't repair that. Repair it. And you can use the bathroom... She's not repairing it. Fine, we'll just replace it then. Jeez, waste of money. Mop it up. Take a shower. Did I tell her to put that away? Don't do that. She actually needs to eat that. You're probably going to want to have some of it too. How much is left? Two. Perfect. Perfection. This little guy's done, so he can go play with a toy. Thank you very much for that, Jesslyn. You can go do this. And then, like I said before, I might just go ahead and have them get jobs. But first, let me have her do this, because her social is low. And then she can also grab a serving. But I might go ahead and have Anna and Jocelyn get jobs, just because we need some supplementary, supplementary income. So I think that's breaking the rules, but hey, we're playing with our own rules here. If you haven't noticed. Um so far why can't you eat eat the salad eat the salad all right it's getting into bedtime territory so let's see where everyone's at okay yeah you go to sleep you not close enough and can you use the bathroom on your own yet darn it isabel how about you stop that and potty train Andrea? Yeah, she's had quite a few mess ups recently. You can stop that and go. How about you go play something? Play some video games or something. Watch funny videos on sim.tv. 
Because why not introduce our children to the internet? The interwebs. You're pretty tired, so I'm going to have you head to bed. Off this. You're getting close. She has 48 followers. Woohoo! It, mul it like multiplies by 12 each time. Like you know, it adds 12 each time. <laughs> All right, Anna. How about you clean that up? And then you can watch TV for fun. Woohoo! Watch romance. Why not feel a little uh, frisky? Or just, you know, not clean things up. That's fine. That's totally fine. Alright, you can go to bed now. Jasper, you can go to bed now. you call your let's have you check your timeline and do simstagram and chat with your dad Hopefully they should push Andrea over the ledge as far as being able to use the potty on her own now. Alright, you can stop that and go to bed. Andrea, you can also go to bed. Yes, I think you finally successfully used it this time. So you can clean that, go play games for a little bit, and then head to bed yourself. Jesslyn, clean these up, and then... Head to sleep. Perfect. I think this was a really smooth get day, guys. I would call this a win in our book. It just helps when they go to school and we can get, like, a break from them for, like, a few hours, which sounds horrible, but that's just the truth of the matter. Oh, my gosh. Oh, it's so dirty in here. She's like, I hate it. I hate it. Well, can you mop that up for us, then? So that it looks nicer. I think that's the actual problem. Yeah, I would definitely call this a win in our book. We got everybody to bed at a reasonable hour for school tomorrow. Perfect. The toddlers did really well on their own today. It wasn't too overwhelming for Isabel. Isabel started working on her next book, The Raven's Head Mistress, which, again, is totally going to be a bestseller. Totally. So yeah, I would say today was a win. A win, win, win. Alright, let's send uh, Isabel to sleep. Turn that light off. Turn these lights off. Alright guys, I think I'm going to end the video here. Thanks so much for watching. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments and down below. And I'll catch you all next time.